Hey y'all, Dower down here in the uh, computer lab, as you can see. Uh, I'm not feeling too well, so sorry if I sound a little funny. I've got a sinus infection to deal with. But I wanted to show you guys something. This is my Logitech K830. And if you look carefully, it's, well, all swollen up. What's going on there, huh? Yeah, I'm not sure. So, I'm thinking, let's go ahead and open this thing up. And this will also make a nice little test of the HTC uh, 10's camera system, right? So this is the front camera, as you can see. I'm liking it so far. I am. Pretty impressed with it. All right. Let's open this thing up. All right. So the first thing we're going to do, flip this thing over. Let's go ahead and remove these four screws. I have a feeling that the swollen up uh, bit on the keyboard is going to be where the battery is. I have a feeling the battery has probably uh, breathed its last. In which case, I want to investigate what size battery it is and whatnot and see if maybe I can replace it. This thing's clearly out of warranty, and even if it wasn't, you know, do I really want to send it back and get the same crappy battery, or do I want to replace it with something maybe a little better? And I can't know what we can do with it until I've actually opened it up and taken a look inside. Alright, let's go ahead and see if we got... Probably have screws underneath the feet. Ah, yep, what did I tell you? Everybody loves to put screws under the rubber feet. I don't really know why. Aside from just to hide them, I guess. I have to figure that's an easy way to hide those screws. Eight screws, huh? Alright, let's see if she comes apart now. Oh, there we go. There we go. Progress. Boom. So I dropped one of the power cables. The power, uh, power button down. There's your power button. Let's go ahead and slide this out of here. I want to tear up any of these clips. There we go. Oh, how about that? Membrane. No, the battery's fine. It's an 1100 milliamp hour single cell. LiPo battery. So what happened there? That's very interesting. Is this a defect that came with it and I never realized it? Well, that's disappointing. I thought I was going to open this thing up and find a messed up battery. And that does not appear to be the case at all. So go ahead and start sliding back together. Let's see if I can't go ahead and make sure this is back on correctly without being all swollen. Clips all the way around. Well, I thought I was going to find a bad battery. Instead, I found, well, not much of anything. Perhaps a clip that had just been popped out. Well, that was anticlimactic. Let's go ahead and get these screws back in. You know, if I'm honest, I'm almost disappointed by this. Uh, I was really looking forward to having some, you know, bad battery in there, and I was going to pull it all apart and replace it. Now I know it's an 1100 milliamp hour battery, though. Fairly standard single cell battery in there. Maybe I'll see about ordering up a 2000 or something and throw in it. Alright, back together. Right as rain. I guess that's what I get for assuming that uh, Logitech didn't know what they were doing. Well, there you go. K30 all back together. Need to recharge it. So I'm going to go and throw it on the charge and let her charge up.
I let it discharge because I thought the battery was dying. I was wrong. How about that?